Oh, oh, it smells rancid. Oh, it's chocolate! We're gonna have you try some Irish snacks today. Irish snacks, woo! High five! Top of the morning to you, laddies. My name's not Zach Tiptekine. Welcome to Irish food. I've had Lucky Charms, but those aren't really Irish. Oh my god, I'm really excited. Cause like, I've never tried anything Irish before, I don't think. I'm Irish! My mom's mom is Irish. I've never been, but I want to go. I'm all up for trying new experiences. Cause I've been trying so many snacks and drinks and vegetables. And this is just raising the bar even higher. So here is your first snack. Ooh, sandwich. It's chips on a sandwich. That's literally the coolest thing ever. It just looks like a sandwich with a chip inside of it. Wait, what? Chips are supposed to be eaten on their own. Or at least with dip or salsa. This looks yummy. It's like Lay's chips, but with creaminess to it. Not bad invention. Oh, the five chip. Not good. Oh, uh, trash can please. Tasted like brick. I love it. I tasted it's butter. Makes it like a flavor of sour cream. I put like chips inside of like sandwiches a lot. It's kind of normal for me. So these are called tato crisps. You are eating salt and vinegar, but the number one flavor pack is cheese and onion. Unfortunately, they are so popular, this option was sold out. It's most commonly eaten like a sandwich on white bread spread with butter. The crisps are in the middle and it is known as the King Crisp Sandwich. In 2010, Tato opened a theme park called Tato Park near Ashbourne. Oh my God. It's crazy that a whole amusement park goes to this. Is it like an amusement park music park or is it just like with potatoes? You opened a theme park out of food. That's weird, but I mean, there's not Sperry Farms, so. Here is your next one. Oh man, is that cheese? Oh, come on. I know, this is some kind of coconut. It looks like peanut butter with like coconut. It looks like someone sued bubble gum, threw it into the dirt, put coconut all over it put strawberries and marshmallows and then decide to eat it. How do you eat this with your hands? This is really gross. <laughs> I feel like I need a spoon or fork or something. Okay, so it's a cherry. It's actually pretty good. I really like this. Tastes like a granola bar. I like it, yeah. Cause it's sweet. And there's a marshmallow and then there's graham cracker and then it's coconut. It's yummy. Too smushy, I don't like smushy foods. So this is known as Irish 15s. It is a popular homemade cookie. Its name comes from the ingredients of 15 marshmallows, cherries, and biscuit crumbs, all mixed together and topped with coconut. Oh my God, that's awesome. I wanna have this every day. Those were very good. I like the sweetness of it. I want some more of that marshmallow. Here is your next. I don't want it to be spicy, because it looks like it's going to be spicy. Is that ketchup? Oh, oh, it smells rancid. I like it. It's basically just a mini pizza. It's not horrible. It actually tastes, with the sauce it tastes good. Oh, that's really bad. It's like, Sweet and sour sauce, teriyaki sauce, and barbecue sauce had a baby. Its texture is wet, watery. It tastes like meatball sauce. I like the bread, because it's a baguette, and I love baguettes. I like the sauce, the sauce is good. It tastes like ketchup. So I'll do my best with the pronunciation. This is Bally Malo relish, typically consumed on burgers, sandwiches, or bread and cheese. I like it, actually. I love In-N-Out, this tastes like an In-N-Out cheeseburger. So instead of like the green relish that we have here, it's like a red relish. I think it's uh, really good. I wouldn't mind if I had like this on some kind of burger or hot dog for me. I would never eat this on a burger sandwich. Here's your next. Ooh! Oh, it's chocolate! It's like a Kit Kat bar. Satisfying. Irish people are awesome. This is what I'm hoping for. Chocolate. Beautiful, sweet, 
plain old chocolate. It says Cadbury. Oh my gosh, this is so good. It's so creamy, delicious. That's super good. I really like that. It tastes like Hershey's um chocolate. I love Hershey chocolate, so this gives it a big win. This is the best chocolate I've ever had. It has a taste that is different from all the other chocolates. So this snack is called a Cadbury Dairy Milk Bar. Cadbury has been making dairy milk in Ireland since 1933, and it is still one of the best-selling and most requested chocolates in the country. Like the Hershey's of Ireland. Can I eat the rest of it? I know what I'm gonna move to next. What's out, Ireland, here I come. Next one. Ooh, looks like banana bread. Smells like kind of rotten banana bread. It just kind of smells like pumpkin bread. This one's probably like the healthy type of bread. It doesn't taste like anything. Kind of bland. And it tastes more like the dough than actual like hard bread. It smells bad, but it's bland. I think that you used it to like soak up like the juice of different stuff. It tastes like normal bread. I would eat it with something on top of it to give it more of a taste, but I mean like it's good. I hate it. I think it's the worst one of all of these. This is Irish brown soda bread. The bread was invented in the interest of creating a loaf that was simple as well as wholesome and nutritious. Brown Irish soda bread requires just a little bit of mixing and no kneading at all. The bread is savory, made with a combination of white and whole wheat flour and oats with toasted wheat germ to give it a nutty depth. Buttermilk brings it all together and keeps the bread from being dry. I mean, it's okay. I mean, I wouldn't say it's bad, but I wouldn't say it's good. Soda bread, why would you call it soda bread? It's good, and it's squishy too. It didn't taste any like anything, but it smelled bad. I guess it's good because it's nutritious. It's good for them bones. Overall, what do you think about all of these Irish snacks? It was surprisingly good. It's super cool. It's um, a new experience for me, so yeah, I really like it. I like trying like other kinds of food. I love them. I am now going to learn how to speak Irish. Isn't, don't Irish people speak English? Never mind. Oh, face palm. Thanks for watching us try Irish snacks on the React channel. What was your favorite Irish snack? Let us know in the comments. Bye, guys. Hello, everyone. Alyssa here, a producer from the React channel. Thanks for checking out these fun Irish snacks with us today. We have a lot of countries to cover, so go ahead and subscribe to be notified when our next video releases.